How's your week going? How's your month? How's your day? Do you understand? Every single damn week! I gotta make something that's good, because I need it. Today, I'm cooking something. We're gonna make a little Genovese. This is just a really nice, light onion and beef kind of ragu, okay? You know those people that say, a Parmigiano. They speak in like normal, and then all of a sudden they see Parmigiano on a menu, and they're like, fucking Parmesan. It's Parmesan cheese. And they're like, a Parmigiano. <laughs> I've done this bit before because it's insane, okay? The first thing I wanna do is I'm gonna take these bone marrows and I'm gonna start roasting them in an oven and then we're gonna take it, scrape all that bone marrow into it and when we finish the pasta, it's gonna be nice, okay? So I got preheated oven, 475, put that in there. Roast it up, all the rendered fat that comes out of it, we're gonna pour just into the sauce, okay? I got a celery and a carrot here. Cut that up. This is easy, hey, this is easy to pick up. I don't know if it's that easy anymore. What happened? We're gonna take this and we're gonna blend this actually. Put this in here. And we're just gonna let that go, let that go, let that go. Come on now. This is a really easy, beautiful dish. Hey, goddamn olive oil. Oh, uh -huh. okay. I made this a couple weeks ago for the first time and Trishy loved it. I'm gonna put a generous amount of olive oil. Then we're gonna turn this on. And this is a very simple pasta that I don't really want it. I'm not doing anything special to it besides really adding the bone marrow, but I feel like that's, you got some chuck, you got a hoof, you got a piece of bone marrow, throw it in the pot, let it stew up. It's nice. We're gonna take our onion, no, carrot and celery and put it into the pot. And we're gonna just start cooking that down a little bit. Nice and low, nice and slow. The thing that's cool about the Genovese, it's like a white kind of, like I'm not putting beef stock in it. We're not really, we're putting a little bit of tomato in it, but it's like, this is a nice little kind of light ragu. This isn't deep flavor. Like I'm not gonna brown the beef. I'm just gonna take the beef and throw it in there, okay? On this episode of Cooking Sun, I'd really like to thank my sponsors, BetterHelp. Is there something in you that's interfering with your goals and just you're riddled with anxiety, possibly depressions, possibly you just feel like the weight of the world's coming down on you and you don't know how to activate yourself? I'm filled with a lot of things every single day. I get a lot of help. Did you know that you can go to betterhelp.com and get a therapist within just a couple days? You fill out a questionnaire and they can help you. Also, if the therapist that you get matched with isn't really the match that you thought you needed, you keep getting matches with therapists and there is no charge to that. You get 10% off if you use my code, betterhelp.com slash Matty, betterhelp.com slash M-A-T-T-Y. There's help out there. Have a great day, okay? Now I'm gonna peel and cut all these onions. We're gonna peel and cut all these onions. We got just some beautiful white onions. We got the red onion, just to mix it up a little bit, give a little dimension to it. We're gonna line up all these onions, then we're gonna slice all these onions. Chop it up, chop it up, chop it up. Take it over here, put it into the pan. Cut onions until you're at the point of being like, stop it. Also, did I just cut all those onions and not a single tear? Yeah, cause my knife is sharp. Turn the heat up a little bit. If your knife is dull and you're pushing into it and it's exploding the onion juice everywhere, your eyes are gonna get fried. Let's get it cooking. Give it a little stir -ski. Make sure you got a nice fucking sharp knife. Figure it out. Jeepers, creepers. So at this point, I'm gonna add a little bit of salt to my onions cause that is gonna help bring out that moisture. Now, we cook all these onions down until they get nice and soft. Oh yeah, this is good. Oh my goodness. Look at this, this is a pot of onions. You thought I was joking. And then the second that these get a little bit caramelized, not super, super, I don't want them super, super caramelized. I just wanna cook these down until they're nice, soft, goldeny, beautiful, lightly caramelized onions. And then we're gonna take our beef and just nestle it in with those onions. And then we're gonna pour in our little tomato, our white wine, our chicken stock, our bay leaves, and that's it. Then we're gonna take our roasted bone marrow, add that to this. 
and we're gonna put it in the oven at 300, 350 degrees for about two to three hours, maybe a little bit longer depending on the beef. And then we're gonna gently cook our pasta. We're gonna take out some of this beautiful Genovese. 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 And we're gonna add the pasta, the onion, the gentle, beautiful beef, a little olive oil, a little Parmesan, a little fresh cracked pepper. This is my love letter. This is my love letter to onions. You're this big, beautiful, punchy onion and you just get sliced up. And you gotta get cooked down. The world's trying to cook you down. That's okay. Cook me down. Cook me down. We're gonna take that bone marrow out. Oh yeah. Look at this. Beautiful roasted bone marrow. Yeah! Our onions are getting to the perfect place where they're just gently caramelizing. The sweetness is coming out. Now, we got three pounds of chuck, just beautifully cut up. You can buy stew meat, whatever you want to do. We're gonna add just half a cup of tomato, two cups of white wine, four cups of chicken stock. Look at this. Oh, this is good right here. We're gonna take our bone marrow, drop that in. We're gonna take our three bay leaves. Boom. We're gonna add just another pinch of salt. And we're gonna take this and we're gonna put it in the oven. And we're gonna cook this at 350 in the oven until it's fork tender. This is a great, great, great dish. And I'm very excited to have it with you. I'll see you soon. We're cooking pasta now, it's, it, it's go time. We wanna season this with some salt. Everybody talks about seasoning their pasta water like fucking assholes. Do it however much you want. Yeah, good. I like it like a ZT, you know, a ZT is cool. Pasta's in. If you put olive oil in your water when you're boiling pasta, you are an asshole. The oil's on top, it's not, it's doing nothing. If you do do it, and you're like an old Nona, and you've been doing it for a hundred years, then, you know, God bless you. But anybody else, shut up. But it's just like, I don't get it. I don't get it. Let's pull out the Genovese, okay? Here we go. Look, <gasps> we got the one I just put in there, but guess what, everybody? We got the one that we made earlier because I'm not sitting around for six hours. Here we go, check this out. We have our beautiful bone marrow. Look at these pieces of meat. <sighs> We're gonna get some beef, some onions, and then we're just gonna kind of break this up a bit. We got some beautiful bone marrow. Look at this. Look at that. We're gonna just scrape all the bone marrow, boom, into it. Like how succulent is this? Bone marrow, all the caramelized onions cooked down, the beef is just falling apart. Holy shit. We're gonna do just some fresh cracked pepper. This is the first time that I'm kind of adding fresh cracked pepper, just a little bit. Guys. Genovese. Oh, we're good now. I could probably get a smaller pan, too. I'm just gonna put it in here, okay? I'm just gonna fucking dump it in here. A little bit of salt, a little bit of fresh cracked pep, a little glug of olive oil. We're gonna let all this beautiful onion beef broth soak into those noodles. Look at this. This is absolutely one of the most beautiful things I've ever made. Here we go, we're plating it up. Look at this. Are you getting tight on this? A little olive oil, a little fresh cracky peppy. Wow. A little parm. This absolutely beautiful thing. Wow. The succulent bone marrow the broken down chuck. This is so good. All that beautiful flavor has gone into the noodles. Like just the meat is so succulent. Mm. Bro, this is crazy. I'm Maddie Matheson. I have you. You have me. We got Genovese. Buongiorno. We're done. We're done. Go enjoy your day. Go jump in a lake. You know, go jump in a lake, have a great time, go for a bike ride, play with your kids, go, you know, braid your hair, whatever you want to do. You know, paint your toenails, paint, make some crafts. I'll see you soon.